you know a lot of people like to give me gifts um it's not that i don't like i don't appreciate it but um i think a lot more people can benefit so um, right. i like to if i get a gift then it's it's me and everyone behind me <laughs> you know so um it's either offering a discount of the right. same type of thing it's you know i honestly believe even in the social media when you're experiencing something and you're talking about it um I'm the same way because when I'm like looking at it and asking somebody, you know, you're looking at somebody like, wow, I wish I could experience that. So give people as much of an opportunity to experience it. So either it's a discount, um, a free trip, right. you know, jewelry. If you remember for my 40th, um, uh, uh, we were giving Tanzanite earrings, diamond bracelets. Um, we did 40 gifts then, you know, so from hotel stays. So something a bit similar like that. And also just being conscious. You know, it's been a very hard year, mm. two years in the pandemic. Mm. You know, a lot of people have lost their jobs. A lot of people have done that. So trying to also partner in a, in a good way in terms of not giving people cash, but, you know, clearing your school bills. Right. I mean, imagine that, you know, clearing your hospital bills, right. um, that kind of stuff, you know, groceries. So we're also looking at those kind of things because if you don't have that as the staple, mm. um, I can't even start giving you a holiday right. if your day-to-day -day needs are not being met. To be honest, I used to have sensational parties, you know, back in the day at Soho's. Um, it's not just after coming into, I think KSC just gave me that platform. Um, of course, and maybe, you know, the family that I belong to, obviously the change, um, you know, people's positions have changed to higher positions. So obviously you're under that, that limelight or that scrutiny, you know, but um, gosh, I don't know, I'm the sort of person where it's like, you know, you it's, celebrate, right. celebrate yourself. Right. you know have a party be be proud of that so you know it's the one day that you can actually toot your own horn <laughs> you know if no one's gonna celebrate you celebrate on your birthday right. type of thing so it's been happening for a very long time but 40th yes was was um was was big and the thing i remember about that was probably um the ripple effect so yes we flew to melindy and had a birthday party that i got to celebrate with my friends my family my my boys that was amazing and i don't take that for granted but i'm also very fortunate to be able to um not in that grandeur every week or every right. month but i'm um, fortunate to be able to meet up with friends and family a lot right. but this one is now being able to um have people also experience that as well you know so with the 40 40 days 40 gifts in 40 days type right. of thing and just um just putting a smile on somebody's face, that's what right. I remember. Right. You know, somebody just you've never met and you're not wanting anything from it. Mm -hmm. You know, um, just, I think that's amazing. Oh. Well, unfortunately, I don't endorse alcohol because I'm a recovering alcoholic. So again, with that, but it doesn't mean that I'm like, oh my goodness, no, because it's a big business. It's it's there, people do it. It's a lifestyle, it's a, um, it's a way of life. So I just, um, you know, I, I like to kind of, maybe I'll give you that club experience instead of just, you know, I don't want to be handing out bottles because um, I, I don't know where it could lead to. You know, I've, I've, um, I'm a recovering alcoholic. Right. So again, it's, um, I don't want to be putting that bottle into somebody's hand who maybe shouldn't be having it. You know, I don't want to change somebody's life for the, for the worst. Right. So um, in terms of that, I tend to kind of politely say, I'm sorry, but this doesn't, you know, fall under my, um, my, my, my vision type of thing. But even with the foundation, one of the key things that actually, my, the one that I really do want to do is, is a rehab, rehabilitation center. Um, it changed my life considerably. I wouldn't be the person who I am today if I had not um, gone through rehab and able, because as an alcoholic, you've got very limited options. Mm. It's either reform, it's remain an alcoholic or death. So your options are very limited. Mm. Um, so I have to say that I'm very, very grateful that it did it did work out. So having said that, I would like to definitely um, do more in, in that space. Right. You know, um, I do a lot of mentoring. I go to schools. I do a lot of things, you know, with that. People message me and ask me to be their mentor. Of course, I vet them and see, right. you know, with that. But um, time, time allow. You know, my day doesn't stop it. Um, you know, I don't even have a conventional nine to five. You know, I go home and that's when I now check my DMs. You know, I can maybe get about 50 to 60 DMs a day asking for help, asking for this. I'm not big on, like I said, just giving cash because you don't know where the end game is. So I say, you know, what is it? Send me the, the, the M-Pesa number for the school fees or better right. still the pay bill. Yeah. Um, send me the hospital medical number right. or details. I'm not just going to just send you money um, with that. So. Good.